just around the river bend, beyond the shore. The crush is coming, the crush is coming. Ah! Oh, sorry, love. Sorry. <laughs> sorry, sorry, No, the Netherlands has a very rich history of art and that continues today with the street art which is all over the city beyond that bus. In the early 1600s, that's the early 17th century, a lot of Dutch artists were inspired by Caravaggio. They would go to Italy, they would hang with Caravaggio, they would copy his work. And today, all over the city, you see people recreating works from the Dutch masters here on office buildings, on blocks, on apartment blocks. We're in a part of town called Overvetched. And behind me, people live just beyond this man. He has very sensuous lips, very full. The Daily Mail would call that a fish gape expression. You know, the lips are like slightly open. Um, yellows, blues. This belongs in the Rijks Museum, the Rijks Museum. It is just so stunning. All I know, it is absolutely amazing. The side says Abraham Blomfart, 1621. Okay, early 17th century, honey. It's it's just absolutely stunning. To live in an apartment building, you could be in his mind, in his brain. Oh my goodness, I absolutely love it. Green City. I have literally been on this bike all day. I feel so fit. I worked my arms on the canoe and now I am working my legs on the bike. I don't need to go to body pump. I don't need to go to yoga because Utrecht is working out my body. Roll of everything, Utrecht canoes. We are at this point right now at the canoe rental in Utrecht. Uh, I'll send you in that direction on the Uitergracht. You come past the Dom Tower. At the end of the Uitergracht, you go to the right and just follow the stream until you come back on the Uitergracht. You go right again and you're back. Okay. Is there any chance we will drown? Uh, it's a little chance, but uh, I think you'll make it. Awesome, thank you. Okay, Katie and I are getting in the canoe. Katie, come! <laughs> Utrecht canoes, you can rent your own canoe and then dive right in. I'm not a swimmer, but hey, we've got this floating canoe. Everything's gonna be okay. Are you ready? Are you ready? Let's, Let's do this! this. <laughs> ay, ay, ay. Woo! Babes! Babes! <laughs> Oh wow, Titanic. We are in the canoes here in gorgeous Utrecht. And I have to say, this is stunning. This is like Amsterdam without the tourists. Exactly, it's so calm, it's so peaceful. Luckily for us, the water is still. So hopefully we'll make it round and we'll get to the other side. Allegedly it's gonna storm and you know what, that would actually be super fun. I would feel like Leonardo DiCaprio on the island. What's it called? Castaway? Is that Tom Hanks? I'm confused in movies. I'll, the island? Well, as long as it's not Titanic. <laughs> Katie, how's it feel? We're getting there. Slowly but 
surely we're getting there. <laughs> Where we're going, we do not know. We hear there is a former prison on this route. I'm gonna pan around so you can see the view. It is stunning. <laughs> There is a big boat approaching. I do not know what to do. Okay, you know how we were joking about Titanic Lusitania? I am pulling over straight away. Oh my God. Okay. You know, in the ancient days, oh, Eco Boot almost gave us the boot, y'all. Yeah. Oh. Hi. The hardest part for me is turning this thing. Oh. Um, I need to turn around. Like, I mean, that's the wrong way. I get so confused with left and right anyway that when I'm in water, it's like all the more complicated. Oh, sorry, <gasps> sorry, sorry. And I found that the best way to stop is to run into something because then you know you're going to stop. I'm sorry. It's very hard for us to go in. Okay. Olympic canoeing. Here we go. <laughs> it's just ahead. It's gonna do it. I'm burning off the Stroop waffle I had on KLM. It was a fake Stroop waffle, but the calories were real. Those calories were real. We are back. Okay, we're turning. I see the canoe master. We're turning. We've made it, Katie. We've made it. Oh. Hello. Oh gosh. Uh oh. Oh, sorry. Blogs, we are used to painting the town pink, but with this zebra crossing, we are painting it red, orange, yellow, blue, indigo, violet, all the colors of the rainbow. As you know, the Dutch are known for being very progressive. I feel completely at ease being myself, crossing the street, crossing this rainbow zebra crossing. It's not black and white. It is every color of the rainbow here in Utrecht. You've got to experience it. So modern, this whole complex by the station. This is not 2020, this is 2040. Tropical honey, yes. I feel like I'm in Burn Gully. 